time ko, Familia. Today is the most awaited rubber matchup between the four teams gunning for a spot sa ating volleyball finals. Ako po si Adi Manzano. Do or die game na nga ng NU Bulldogs at ng Adamson Soaring Falcons. Magtatagumpay ba ang team ni Coach Dante o ni Coach Doming? Ako naman po si Justin Quirino. Last chance na ng De La Salle Lady Spikers at ng FEU Lady Tamaraws na makaharap ang defending champions para sa ating finals. Ako po si Natasha Alquiroz and this is... Up front at the UAAP! Sure guys, hindi naman ako ang nagulat sa games last Sunday kasi grabe, you never know what to expect this season 78. Tama ka dyan, Adi. Alam mo yung, yung uh, number 3 seed, mm -hmm. Adamson Soaring Falcons team natin. Of course, they erased the NU Bulldogs as twice to beat advantage, forcing our game today, our deciding game today, that's at 2 p.m. mga kapamilya. At alam mo, Justin, the same thing can also be said para sa women's side, the FEU Lady Tamaraws played impressive volleyball as they went up against the De La Salle Lady Spikers and winning the game after five thrilling sets and of course, forcing a do-or-die match for today. Sino kaya ang makakalaban ng Ateneo Lady Eagles para sa ating finals? Malalaman natin yan at 4 p.m. That's, right. That's right. So, good luck to the teams playing today. At before natin simulan ang winner-take-all matches later on, balikan muna natin ang mga exciting moments ng men's semifinals. Let's watch this. After all the hard work and the sweat and tears, welcome to the Final Four. The defense of UP. Uh, take a look at Josh Villanueva. Good reception. Combination play. That's it. That's what UP needs. Come on, kid. They go to Espejo. Yes. Acuna back set. Espejo again against Villete. And again, he's rejected. What a great job by the rookie. They can execute. Valdelovar. Oh, that's too low, but they get the point. Three balls for Ateneo, here we come. It's Balbuena again, and he scores. It's Oh, that's good. Yeah, a good rally going on here. Baisa is blocked on the first time. Ital scores. Yes! Match point for Ateneo, 24-13. Back, he's asking for it. The combination is there for Valdueno. If they can... Oh! Second finals appearance, or probably a second chance to get a championship back-to-back. The National University Bulldogs look to make it back to the finals as they take on the Adamson Soaring Falcons. Dave Plentano dashing and smashing. Marcos setting it up and a block there. Just back to the end of the side. Back to the end of the And Plentano in for saves that one. Here's Saura again. A back set for Balsak. Saura. And you is able to end the set. Facial right there. Ramirez one handed. Fletano. Even though they have the most explosive hits, but he's on the floor right now. They are Dante. Ooh! Tossing it up to nobody. Molabdan. Back set for Natividad. 23 to 21, Sotaria breaks down the wall. The momentum has turned in the favor of the soaring Falcons. Nobody that you understand. Hey! 
advanced ball to Ramirez, tossing it up for Sundaria. 16 to 12 in favor of NU. Combination play. Chance for Adamson to get a good offensive play. Trying to get over the hook. And Adamson is one step closer to doing that as they shot the second track and you pulled up today in the final four. Woo! Grabe yung ibang mga spike talaga. Napakalakas. At alam mo, ano, Tasha, Adi, nakita naman natin ang intensity ng laro nila, di ba? At evident talaga na silang dalawa gusto talaga nilang manalo. But unfortunately for UP, Ateneo won this one. Uh -oh. And uh, ayon nga sa, ano, sa mga sinabi ng analyst natin, na yung kapunan ni Coach Oliver is a complete team from offense to defense. But of course, congratulations pa rin sa UP. Kahit makasama ka lang sa Final Four, isang malaking accomplishment na rin yun. That's right, yun, eh, That's right Justin. Yeah. And of course, on the other hand, congratulations then to the Adamson Soaring Falcons. Though, medyo bumaba yung performance nila throughout the second round ng ating elimination round. Bumawi naman sila ngayon, even erasing NU's twice to beat advantage. And of course, forcing a knockout game for today. Ooh. That's right, Tasha. Full of surprises talaga ang Season 78. And when we come back, silipin naman natin ang mga unforgettable moments ng women's semifinals at syempre our Twitter question of the day when upfront at the UAAP returns. an episode of Upfront at the UAP or if you want instant access to UAP game highlights just log on to sports.abs-cban.com go to UAAP select videos select the sport and select the game highlight for previous episodes of our shows simply click on the video icon and via the ABS-CBN Sports in Action YouTube channel. Get to watch the latest episode of Upfront of the UAP for fun and inspiring features on your favorite UAP athletes. Everywhere, every game. Scoring and scoring. Oh, that accuracy is uncanny. You're still watching up front at UAP. At grabe naman kami sa naman Adi Manzana, di ba? First time namin na mag-host together. Oh, after that's right. In the history oh, of no. up front. Three months, di ba? Never. I've only heard tales of this Adi Manzana. Hopefully which good tales. Uh, <laughs> yung iba, yung iba naman, di ba? But of course, we're here to talk about more important things like like Tasha was talking about. Yung, yung Ateneo ngayon, napakalakas. Of course, you know, the, the men's team, they're gunning for their their back-to-back -back championship. The women's team are going for a three-peat naman. And of course, fifth finals appearance then ng women's team ng Ateneo. Yes, and it's so funny because both the Ateneo men's and women's team have their very own cheer rallies, which is... Oh, yeah. Oh, oh. Yo, for all you for Ateneo, para sa women naman is one big fight for history. Yeah, History. For history. Oh, oh. Okay. Now, last weekend, of course, we witnessed how the defending champions claimed their fifth straight Finals appearance at at ginulat nirin tayo ng kopanan ni ni Coach Shaq as they snatched a win against the De La Salle Lady Spikers. So balikan natin ang mga exciting moments. Here are the game highlights of the women's semifinals. Good luck, Ateneo Lady Eagles and Jamie Lavatoria. Um, best of luck to all of you guys. Well, of course, ang gagaling nila, especially Isa Molde. 
and all the other rookie players. I believe in our team. Ang daming magagaling ngayon. And I think this is a good year for us. The first Final Four matchup, the two-time defending champions are going up against ang mga bagong salta. Three ball again, back-to-back for Ateneo. Amy asks for it. That's why. Back-to-back hit. Combination play, sent back! Ah, oh. look at Morado. Ito naman sa kabila. Parang si Bolde yung ina-attake nila. That is out, sayang! Oh. Ahumiro, just the right height. One half oh, set. And a quick set of that. Back set to Tiamzon. Three. Who's there? Persona with the left hand. Persona with the right hand. Wild rally. Oh! Morado goes to Valdez. Valdez puts it away. Gets her team into their fifth consecutive finals appearance. Kulang yung talagang yung lahat sila talagang decidido na manalo. Pati Scott Stay talagang hindi nasa umupo talagang piling na niya lahat yung kawa ano mga play na gagawin. Nay, nay o, love you, bye bye, see you, bye lola. Can the FEU Lady Tamaraos do the same as they try to halt the DLSU Lady Spikers who are looking to book a return to the finals? Basas powers it through. Oh, nobody there. Nobody home. Oh. The Bumuelo. The ticket ticket the finals appearances. Good dig there by Pasas. Points in the middle. C in the middle. Oh. And Buhay Pa on FEU. Dala puts that one away. Okay. Nobody hold for the side. Fajardo opens up to the other side to Aragala. Fajardo chooses Demisilio. That rolls out. They say it's out. No! Oh, no! No! Yeah! Game's not over and semi's not over. So one more game. We can get it on Wednesday. Go Lasal! Tibayan nyo pa yung sarili nyo sa pagkatalo na to. Accept nyo lahat ng pagkakamali, pagkukulang. Laban ulit. Walang hihinto. Walang bibitaw. Lock sa game nyo sa... Wednesday at kaya nyo yan. Nagpapasalamat sa mga prayer ng lahat ng mga fans, supporters ng FEU, sa mga teammates ni Buding, talagang nag-work hand in hand to make this game a success. Sa mga players ko, hopefully, wag kayong magsasawa, wag mag-give up. Nandito na tayo, so trabawin natin mabuti and sobrang proud kami sa inyo at mahal naman namin. Abby are defending champions led by the Queen Eagle herself, Eliza Valdez, na nag-aantay na lang kung sino ang makakaharap nila para sa ating finals. At syempre, hi na rin kay Tito Ruel, of course, the proud father of the phenom in UAP Volleyball. And of course, oh, oh, ang cute nga nila, nakahug pa sila. And of course, we also want to say good job na rin to Coach Jerry and of course, the UP Lady Maroons. Ang main goal nila para sa season na ito ay para makapasok sa loob ng Final Four. At nakamit nila ang goal nila this season. And of course, as Justin was saying earlier, being in the Final Four is an achievement also in itself. Yes. That's right, Tasha. And also, napaka-intense ang matchup ng La Salle and FU as well, diba? Because, of course, if you saw, um, FU was down in the first two sets and they were able to catch up and grab that win. So I'm sure, proud na proud si Coach Nak sa team niya, right? And also, hi to the mom and brother of Rhea Durandis who were also present in that game last Hi. Sunday. Hi, guys. <laughs> Dami mga family appearances. Yes. Na.
it's Kakatoa. And of course, because Adamson and FEU destroyed the twice to beat advantage of NU and LaSalle, and they've come this far, papayag pa kaya sila na matalo today. Excited na excited na tayo na, na natin malaman kung ano mangyayari dito. But of course, it's time for us to ask you guys what your opinion is. Let's get to our Twitter question of the day. Since marami na ang nag-step up sa games noong semifinals weekend, sino-sino sa tingin nyo ang mga players na may notable contributions during those games at bakit? That's already posted on our official Twitter account. All you have to do is follow us on Twitter and Instagram at Upfront at UAP. At syempre, mga kapamilya, gamitan nyo rin ang aming hashtag Upfront at UAP S78 para makita na namin ang inyong mga sagot. That's right, guys. Tweet nyo lang kami and we will read your answers later on the show. And when we return, Gina had a jam session with our very own Anton Rojas. Magbabalik ang Upfront at the UAP. Or if you want instant access to UAP game highlights, just log on to sports.abs-cban.com. Go to UAAP, select videos, select the sport, and select the game highlight. For previous episodes of our shows, simply click on the video icon. And via the ABS CBN Sports in Action YouTube channel. Get to watch the latest episode of Upfront of the UAP for fun and inspiring features on your favorite UAP athletes. Welcome back to Upfront of the UAP. Oh, Adi, Tasha, okay pa kayo? Okay, okay pa grabe. Masyadong intense dito sa Arena. Medyo intense yung atmosphere dito sa Mall of Asia Arena. Kaya medyo mag-chill muna tayo, no? Okay. We prepared a quick jamming session with, with one of the most esteemed UAP anchors here for UAP Volleyball, Mr. Anton Rojas. With him, of course, is our very own Janina Chen. Singing as always, here's our latest edition of UAP Jam. Hi mga kapamilya, so for today's edition of UAAP Jam, iibahin naman natin ng konti dahil hindi athlete ang makakajam ko, pero lagi nyo siyang nakikita sa mga UAAP games. So, sino kaya to? Tara mga kapamilya, let's go! He's one of the most competent and promising sportscasters that we have here at ABS-CBN Sports and Action. But today, makikita natin ang ibang side naman ni Anton Rojas. That's him. <laughs> Hi. Hello, Anton. Hello. It's about time you come visit me here in my man. At ngayon kasama ko na si at Mr. Pure Business himself, Anton Rojas. Pero mas makikilala nga natin ang iba pang side niya. So, Anton, kailan ba nagsimula yung interest mo with music? Um, I actually used to be in a band in college. So, we decided to form this college band called Moon Punch. Ano pa ba yung mga hilig mong gawin? What are your other hobbies at iba pang mga outlets mo? Well, pangarap ko talaga growing up was to become a professional basketball player. At si Michael Jordan talaga yung pinakamagaling na basketball player. Siya talaga yung life idol ko. Alright, this is one of my most memorable moments in my life because uh, I was able to see the Michael Jordan statue in Chicago. This was in 2013. Well, I like to travel. Mm. Uh, I really love traveling. Every oh, time I God. travel, I, I really make it a point to get magnets so I can remember yung mga lugar na napuntahan ko. At ayan na ang mahiwagang ukulele ni Anton. I started when one of my good friends, Myrtle Sarosa, brought her ukulele to this event that we cover. And she played a song for me and I was mesmerized. Uh, we're going to sing one of the easiest songs to learn on the uke. Um, it's a song called I'm Yours by Jason Mraz. It's, it's one of the first songs na tinuturo ng mga ukulele t-shirt. Well, you done done me and you bet I felt it. I tried to be chill but you're so hot that I melted. I fell right through the cracks. Now I'm trying to get back. Go, Janina. Before the cool time ran out, I'll be giving it my best days. But nothing's gonna stop me but the bad intervention. I reckon it's again my turn. To win some or learn some, but I won't hesitate. 
is a tape No more, no more It cannot wait I'm your There's no need to complicate Our time is short This is our fate I'm yours Yeah! Uh, Sobrang sobra nag-enjoy ako. Napaka-chill nung kantang yun. Nakaka-relax. So, once again, this has been Janina Chan for UAAP Jam. Dito lang sa Upfront at the UAAP. So, so I, I won't hesitate no more, no more. It cannot wait. I'm yours. <laughs> oh my God. <laughs> Hey, hello, you're back. Hey, hello there. Hi, guys. So, Anton, if you're listening, we want to ask you, Anton, where did you learn to sing and play the UAAP? What? Wow, I've been playing for five weeks. Hey, guys. 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 I've been playing for five weeks. Hey, Sinaman niyo kami, kasi clearly may talent din ka nga, di ba? Si Adi, di ba? Si Adi lang may edo talent. Pagkita siya. Anyway, thanks so much, Anton. And good job on your ukulele. And singing with Janina. Oo, but syempre, of course, before we get carried away, alam naman natin ang mga UAP fans natin sa Twitter, overflowing din ang kanilang mga reactions para sa magiging outcome ng ating mga games ngayong hapon. Kaya naman, babasahin na naman ang ilan sa inyong mga sagot sa aming Twitter question of the day. Okay, for our first tweet, we have from Joyce Raquel. She says, I think Kim Kiana D. Super laki ng tulong niya sa team. Consistent na mga plays niya. Hashtag upfront at UAAP at 78. Hashtag hearts out DLSU. And I super agree with that because Kim D definitely stepped up the second round and is playing a very, con uh, is contributing very well to the team right now. That's right. Our next tweet is coming in from Winston Octavian. Sabi niya, Remy Palma, the leader of FEU, na nagbigay confidence sa team niya. Of course, you know, si Captain Remy really carried her team, especially in the momentous win against the Lady Spikers last Sunday. Grabe yun. Grabe talaga yung match na yun. And of course, our third tweet is coming from Giselle Tan. For me, it's Eliza Valdez. Siya yung nag-deliver ng mga crucial points. Hashtag clutch. Hashtag, Hashtag clutch. <laughs> Once again, the Phenom, of course, delivered crucial points for Ateneo in their semi-final match against the against UP last Saturday. And of course, the reason why they're in the finals and mag-aantay na nga lang tayo between FEU and of course, DLSU. Kung sino nga ang makakalaban nila. Yeah, exactly, guys. So hey. thank you so much for your tweet. And clearly, lahat ng mga fans natin ng LAN ay sobrang excited para sa matches today. But in the meantime, let's check in with our panelists for today, Anton and Doc Ian. Hi, Hello guys. again, Anton. Hi, guys. Hi, guys. So, Hi, guys. So, <laughs> so, <laughs> so, <laughs> so, <laughs> so, so wala na ako ng partner. I think iba ka rin. So, inagaw nyo na siya, eh. <laughs> <laughs> Um, okay. So guys, since we witnessed natin last Sunday how the Adams and Soaring Falcons and the FU Lady Tamaraws erased the twice the beat advantage of their opponent, for you naman Anton, um, how how should the how should the NU Bulldogs and the De La Salle Lady Spikers play today, or what should they do naman in order to win their games today? Well, for NU against Adamson, I think they have to limit their errors. They committed 35 errors. Yeah, that's so and much. that's just uh, unacceptable yeah. for mm -hmm. Coach Dante Ellen Sunurin. Para sa akin, they have to limit that. And I think Vince Mamulabnan has to do a better job with showing more variety and using the middle. Uh, let's see if he will get Kim Malabunga, who's six foot six, involved in this game para maging uh, mas mahirap. Yeah. Madepensa ng opensa ng Bulldogs. Uh, women's division naman. Well, for uh, tong FEU and of course itong Adamson alam naman natin they already took that first step. Yes. You know, that's the most important step that they had to make. And now they have to keep their eye on the prize and it's been done before. They got to keep in mind na talagang na nagawa na to dati, no? So hindi enough na nanalo na sila nung first game. They have to look at it and go all the way. And they have to believe. They could have to continue believing. And I think like what you said, minimizing errors for any team in this kind of a situation is a must. And of course, have that confidence na kaya nilang tapusin up to the very end. FEU will try to shock the world again. <laughs> yeah. 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 And of course,
course, maraming salamat, Anton, and of course, Doc Ian, para sa inyong mga insights. Do or die match na talaga ang mangyayari in just a bit between the NU Bulldogs and the Adamson Soaring Falcons. Sino kaya ang makakaharap ng Ateneo Blue Spikers sa ating finals? Malalaman na natin yan. And of course, before we go, we'd want to greet our very own Kapamilya co-host and of course, my friend Gretchen Ho. A belated happy, happy birthday. Hey! Happy birthday, happy birthday Gretchen. Gretchen. Oh, happy birthday. And of course, that's all the time we have for now, mga Kapamilya. Kita-kita ulit tayo mamaya dito lang sa inyong exclusive source on all things great about the UAP. This has been Up Front at the UAP. See you guys later. Won't hesitate no more, no more.